Uh, I'm not originally from L.A. I come from New York. I'm one of the uh, New York Puerto Ricans. And, well, not really, not completely, because uh, my father's Hungarian. <laughs> so I'm a Hungarian. <laughs> That's why I, I know I don't look it, right? I got light skin, straight hair. That's from my father. From my Puerto Rican mother, I got my nose and my mustache. <laughs> I grew up in New York in a neighbor called uh, Washington Heights. It's not really a ghetto, it's a ghetto suburb. Right? Slums with trees. Right? Even the birds are junkies. Birds don't know how to fly, they just fall out of trees and bother people. Right? Tweet, tweet, sucker, give me a quarter. <laughs> Cockroaches wear sneakers and dungarees. And... Cockroaches are strong, you can't kill them. You ever notice? You step on them, you hear them snap. As soon as you lift your foot, they run like hell. That's because they know we believe the snap means they're dead, so they're going, chump, and they're gone. Yeah. We have a, a, the manager of the apartment building, the superintendent's name is Mr. Rivera, Puerto Rican guy. And you can't complain to him, right? He's one of those managers, doesn't want to fix anything, but he wants a key to the apartment anyway. In case of an emergency, like he needs a few dollars. And you go to complain to him, he answers the door, so you feel guilty, right? Uh, he has his kids here, and you go, hey, Rivera, no hot water for 20 years, and uh, no walls in the apartment anymore. <laughs> fix that when you have a chance. He's always, he's bothered by it. He's not my job. <laughs> he got mad that I said that on television. He came to me in the lobby. He said, Freddy, why you make fun of me? Uh, do I bother you? I don't bother nobody. I'm a nice man, but you talk about me again, I kill you. <laughs> I said, if you don't like it, why don't you shut off the set? He goes, he's not my job. <laughs> He gives people a wrong impression of Puerto Ricans. Like, uh, Nixon has a wrong impression of Puerto Ricans. I blame him that there's no Puerto Rican astronaut. Right? What are they afraid of? All the way to the moon will blow the horn, play the radio. <laughs> he probably figures, right, we'll stick our head out the window going, Mira, chica, hello, honey. Right. We'll put pom-poms on the antennas. And a little dog in the window with the head. <laughs> what they're really afraid of is we'll get to the moon, right? Unload the moon buggy, the hubcaps are gone. <laughs> like, it's sad to say, but our society is based on a thing where when one ethnic group makes it, you subjugate another one, right? Like, years ago, it was black people, because you need somebody to clean the toilet. Like, years ago, it was black people. Ain't this a shame? <laughs> Help this sucker flush himself away. You know what I mean? Leave the water running, you know? And when they made it, Puerto Ricans wouldn't they? It's not my job, what I'm doing here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. See, that's why, that's why Chinese people don't want Latins to make it, because they know they're next. <laughs> I should have never roughed the laundry. I don't know what happened here. <laughs> but don't let the Indians get in, because if the Indians get in, they blow up the bathrooms, we can't go, and they take the country back. <laughs> right? Now, Nat was telling me, my friend Nat is this black dude that plays Trump. He's got a big fro and sunglasses and very hard looking dude. And uh, he was telling me things about black people I didn't know. Like, uh, he said, black people, when they get mad, they talk real high, right? But when they, with a girl, they're very low voice and cool, right? Like, you see a guy, he's trying to tell his woman he'll be right with her. And meanwhile, he's arguing with something. Right when they get mad, they go, Say, man, what the hell is wrong with you? You know, I can't. Hey, man, don't make me kill you, okay, man? I'll break your nose. If you bleed, I'll kill your mother. <laughs> Yeah, baby, I'll be right with you, mommy. Don't worry. Yeah, I'll be right with you. Just let me take care of this. Hey, man, let me tell you one thing. <laughs> now, Nat, Nat was with me when I got busted. I was driving without license or registration. It wasn't my car. I didn't get it. <laughs> and the day I don't have license or registration, my luck, a cop pulled me over. And cops always just, you know, they assert themselves by chewing gum hard. Hey, son, you know you left for a tail I was out of order? I bet you didn't. <laughs> Listen, uh, I'm gonna give you a break this time, but if I see you in an hour and that ain't fixed, you're in big trouble. I said, thanks for the break. Next gas station, I have it fixed. I said, all right, beat it. Ready to let me go. And that says, hold on, you got rights. <laughs> I'm back here, turkey. <laughs> you looking to make some money, man? Don't mess with my man when he's high. <laughs> Six months, right? If it had been a Puerto Rican cop, I wouldn't have got busted. Arrest her kid. He's not my guy. 